what kind of teaching moments are in this film. Um, it really uh, forces us to stay vigilant on, I think, these subjects at the LA riots, which have a deep civilizational traumas at their roots, are, it's extremely important to, to generate dialogue about them. And uh, it's our way of, you know, like always putting it on the table, always being uh, vigilant about them, so yeah. Hi there. Um, I'm just wondering, I mean, it's obviously after the, the success of Mustang, which is incredible. Obviously, you've now got doing your first big sort of American story. Uh, what was it about this particular tale and this particular era that really appealed to you as a, a filmmaker? Well, it was really a huge resonance between uh, uh, events that I was living in France and the LA riots. So, um, it's yeah, a recognition of uh, problematics which are not necessarily mine, but which echo completely mine. And yeah. That was the, the starting point. I mean, how much do you owe to the success of Mustang? Do you think it's really given you now this platform to tell stories that you perhaps may not have been able to tell otherwise? Well, the uh, LA uh, Kings is a 11 year old project. So I, I wrote it way before Mustang. I spent years on it. And eventually, at some point, after five and a half, six years, when it stalled, I started Mustang as an evil master plan to do Kings after. And it worked. So it's, um, yeah, it. It has given me the amount of freedom that I needed to make this film. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys! Hey You Guys, huh? Is that from the Goonies? Nice. Hey You Guys!